I have been getting requests for pictures of the apartment for rent on 28 Orange Street. And I thought it might be best to actually do a walking tour. So here's a video. In through the front door, these are the front stairs. Actually, the only stairs going upstairs. And the French doors leading into the living room will come back through that way. The hallway down to the kitchen. New stove. Ceramic tile floor. Under cabinet lighting. A newer faucet with a hose. And this would be the backyard for the apartment. Let's step up there for a moment. has its own little deck, its own shed, very nicely landscaped, hoping that someone will move in that has a green thumb and likes to work on that stuff. So this garden on the left is a shared garden with the next door neighbor and the hedges mark the border. Hallway with came down, refrigerator, that's the door to the basement, lots of storage, hookups for washer and dryer, a closet here, hang your coats, it's got a couple shelves in it. I am uh, doing painting and repairing, so please excuse my equipment that's around. This is the dining room, hardwood floor, ceiling fan, nice pillar archway into the living room, lots of windows and light. The air conditioner does not come with the apartment. I used it while I was working in here. Thermostat for the whole house. Another closet, which has some of my tools in it while I'm working here. But lots of shelves. Hardwood floors. There's not a light in the ceiling of this room. By the way, this floor has nine foot ceilings. The switch next to the French door here operates, I believe, that outlet. So a light would have to be placed there. Another closet. Not quite as deep, lots of small shelves for DVDs and a larger shelf up on top. And a squeaky door. Once again, the French doors going out into the hallway that we already passed through.
and up the stairs. Nicely carpeted. At the top of the stairs, there is a linen closet for your bedroom linens. Once again, lots of shelves. The bathroom. On the bucket list of repairs is a new floor for this room. Hopefully to be installed soon. There's the lights over the sink and then another light and exhaust fan in the ceiling. Lots of space here for another cabinet or storage of some sort. But there is a closet for the bathroom linens. Lots of shelves. The back bedroom the smaller of the two bedrooms. Nice floor to almost ceiling windows. Very airy. I didn't measure it, but I'm going to guess it's at least 12 by 14. Two windows and a closet here. Typical bedroom closet, one rail, one shelf. One of the switch, one of the outlets in here is operated by that switch. I believe it's the one next to the window, but I'm not sure. The front bedroom. Easily 14 by 14, maybe 14 by 16. Three windows. This is one wall that I still need to paint and spackle a little. By the way, all the windows throughout the first and second floor our replacement windows. They're new, they're tilt in, they're double pane. Another typical bedroom closet. One rail, one shelf. And now, off to the third floor. This is what's listed as a multi-purpose room. Very nicely done over with knotty pine. Two ceiling fans. Large room. Oh, more than 20 feet, 24 feet from one end to the other. Two small windows. Some more shelves right there. A large walk-in closet. Has two racks in it for hanging. This can be modified. Shelves can easily be put in. You can put bureaus in here. It's a large closet, lots of room. Yeah. 
this is practically five feet across from that side to that side and same over here on the bucket list of things to do is to put some heat up here that's why I have to put it as a multi-purpose room because there's no heat I can't advertise it as a bedroom I can tell you firsthand though that if you leave the door open at the bottom of the stairs it stays plenty warm up here but I hope to in the future add a couple of baseboard electric heaters and maybe even divide it into two rooms which would make this a four bedroom apartment but right now this is what it is there's some additional storage up here which is in the back side of this closet. Which has a window in it. And a couple shelves. Once again, could easily put a rail in here for clothes. Move shelves around. It's a nice room, has its own circuit breaker panel, that's on the bucket list to put a cover on that so it's not quite so ugly. And that is it. Give me a call if you'd like to fill out an application or for a personal tour.